What does a voltage drop in the cables have to do with the electrical system? The voltage drop has many definitions, but it may be defined as the amount of voltage loss that occurs through all or part of the electrical circuit due to the resistance or impedance. Cables or wires carrying electrical current always have resistance or impedance to the current flow. An analogy used to understand the voltage drop in a garden is a garden hose. Voltage is analogous to the water pressure supplied to the hose. Current is analogous to the water flowing through the hose. The resistance of the hose is determined by the type and size, similar to the type and size of the electrical wire determining its resistance. Let's review the causes of the resistance in the conductor path. The material, copper or aluminum. Copper is a better conductor and will have less voltage drop than the aluminum for a given length and wire size. The wire size, larger wire sizes will have less voltage drop than the smaller wire sizes of the same length. The current being carried, the voltage drop increases on a wire with an increase in the current flowing through the wire. Effect of the circuit length in the voltage drop. Shorter wires will have less voltage drop than longer wires for the same wire size. For the same wire size in a circuit length of 10 feet, the voltage drop will be 3 volts, but the 100 feet of length, the voltage drop will be 10 volts. The general equation for voltage drop can be used to demonstrate the size of conductor knowing wire sizes, lengths, and types under load. The main variables involved in the calculations are source voltage, voltage at load, the current in the cable or circuit, the impedance or resistance, and the cable length. Southwire has a voltage drop calculator for an online application or it is available for the Apple or Android systems. You just download the app from the Apple or Google Play Store. The applications provide voltage drop calculations based on the system parameters such as circuit length, system phases, conductor material, and installation. The basic input parameter for the calculations are minimum conductor size or maximum circuit distance, the voltage of the systems, the maximum allowed voltage drops, and the current in the circuit or system.